I'm pretty sure most of us have had this, the COVID-19 vaccine shot. And of course, we've heard about the side effects from these jabs. One of them could be heart complications and a team here in Singapore has found a link between the shots and heart issues. So let's get to the point with the study's lead investigator, Professor Wee Eng Yong. Prof, based on my understanding of the study, the link between heart complications and the shots is one particular enzyme in the body. Could you explain to us in simple terms what that link is? Yes, thanks very much. The, the, the enzyme is called RNA, RNAs2. Uh, and anything that ends with ASE or AS is an enzyme, right? And this enzyme cuts RNA, right? So because it's an RNA vaccine, this enzyme is going to chop up the vaccine and then that use the, the fragments of the vaccine to trigger an immune response, right? So that, that's the, the ultimate factor. But, but as you re read in the report, it's more than just RNAs. There's, uh, there are several other things happening in this, this uh, person, um, which means that for, for this entire event to occur, the cardiac complication to occur, everything must line up. It's like all the planets must be aligned for this, this event to occur, and which is why we think it's such a rare event, right? It's not just RNAs 2 alone, although that's the, you know, the final shot at goal, as it were, but you still need all the players to be in the right place at the right time. But the sample size in your study is really small. <laughs> How can you be sure of these findings? Mm. Yeah, that's a very good question. The, unfortunately, there's no way of doing this in a statistically, you know, meaningful kind of study where you have, let's say, compare 10 patients to 100 others who, are, who didn't have any problems. Uh, it, it's such a rare event, right? So we can't find those 10 uh, and recruit them at the right time. I mean, the unique thing about our study is that we got the blood sample before he got the vaccine. So it's impossible to do that, uh, you know, at a meaningful um, uh in a kind of like a usual conventional study. So the, our finding though, can what, what we can do though, is once we now know the mechanism, which is what our paper was about, once you know the mechanism, we can nonetheless go ahead and tweak the vaccine in such a way that we, it will be less likely to trigger such cardiac uh, complication. Professor Wee, thank you for your perspectives.